In a world increasingly reliant on internet access for education, healthcare, business and daily life, Starlink emerges as a game changer. Developed by SpaceX, a private aerospace manufacturer and space transportation company founded by Elon Musk, Starlink aims to bridge the digital divide through an extensive constellation of low Earth orbit satellites. These satellites provide high-speed, low-latency internet access to even the most remote regions of the globe, offering the promise of connectivity where traditional infrastructure falls short. With significant backing from investors and a visionary goal of global internet access, Starlink represents the frontier of technological innovation. Since its initial deployment in 2019, Starlink has expanded rapidly, with thousands of satellites already orbiting Earth. The system's unique advantage lies in its ability to reach underserved and rural communities, empowering them with resources previously beyond their grasp. This effort has far-reaching implications for global development, potentially reshaping education, healthcare and economic opportunities in regions with poor or non-existent connectivity. Starlink's global impact is a bold step towards a more interconnected world, with South Asia poised to benefit from this revolutionary shift. Welcome to the Global Insight. Starlink's unique operational framework has captured global attention for its capacity to address the persistent challenge of internet accessibility. The system relies on a constellation of low Earth orbit or LEO satellites that orbit closer to the planet compared to traditional geostationary satellites. This proximity allows Starlink to deliver high-speed internet with low latency averaging between 20 to 40 milliseconds and data speeds ranging from 100 to 200 megabits per second. These attributes make it a viable solution for regions where conventional broadband infrastructure is either unavailable or prohibitively expensive. The genius of Starlink lies in its interlinked network of satellites, ground stations and user terminals. Each satellite communicates with the others and with terrestrial stations to ensure seamless data transfer, a process that Meyer highlighted in their 2021 analysis as transformative for underserved areas. This architecture is particularly well suited for rural and remote locations where traditional fiber optic cables and cellular towers are impractical or economically unfeasible. SpaceX's technological innovation enables individuals in these areas to access education, telemedicine and economic opportunities that were once out of reach. By targeting underserved regions, Starlink exemplifies how cutting-edge technology can reduce disparities in global connectivity. As the system continues to expand, it paves the way for a future where access to the digital world is no longer a luxury but a fundamental right. For countries across South Asia where millions still lack reliable internet, this paradigm shift holds transformative potential. Starlink's entry into developing countries like Sri Lanka and Nepal underscores its capacity to revolutionize connectivity in regions where traditional infrastructure struggles to meet demand. By leveraging satellite technology, Starlink offers a pathway to improved education, healthcare and economic growth, especially for rural and remote populations. Each nation presents unique opportunities and challenges for Starlink's deployment, shedding light on the broader impact of satellite-based internet in underserved areas. Sri Lanka's bold step to grant Starlink a license for operations highlights its commitment to modernizing the telecommunications sector. The Telecommunications Regulatory Commission issued this landmark license in August 2024 following reforms under a new telecommunications bill. These developments, prompted by discussions between President Ranil Vikramasinghe and Elon Musk, signal a forward-thinking approach to improving nationwide internet access. 
As noted in the Daily Star's 2024 analysis, Sri Lanka's 22 million residents stand to benefit significantly from Starlink's high-speed internet services, particularly in remote regions where connectivity remains unreliable. The ripple effects of Starlink's presence extend across sectors. Reliable internet access could enhance education, making online learning more accessible, while tourism and other industries could flourish with dependable digital communication. Additionally, the updated regulatory framework fosters competition among internet providers, potentially lowering costs for consumers. As reported by Silicon Republic in 2024, these market dynamics create a fertile ground for innovation, ensuring Sri Lanka reaps both economic and social rewards from this new connectivity frontier. Nepal, with its mountainous geography, presents a compelling case for the benefits of Starlink satellite technology. Traditional internet infrastructure faces significant hurdles in the region, leaving many rural communities disconnected. According to Shretha's 2022 study, Starlink's low Earth orbit satellites could bypass these geographical challenges, providing internet access even in the most isolated areas. However, Nepal's legal requirements for foreign investments to involve local partners complicate Starlink's entry into the market. Despite these obstacles, Starlink's potential to uplift Nepal's rural communities is undeniable that improved internet access could catalyze economic activities such as remote work and online businesses offering new income streams for isolated populations. Similarly, reliable connectivity could transform education and healthcare by enabling telemedicine and e-learning platforms. While regulatory challenges remain, the long-term benefits of enhanced digital inclusion could redefine Nepal's socio-economic landscape. Starlink's ventures in Sri Lanka and Nepal demonstrate how innovative technologies can address long-standing connectivity issues. These case studies highlight the importance of collaborative policymaking and adaptive strategies to unlock the full potential of satellite internet in developing nations. Starlink's expansion into South Asia introduces transformative dynamics for regional giants like India and China, with implications that go beyond connectivity. In India, Starlink represents a critical tool for bridging the digital divide, while in China it serves as both a competitor and a catalyst for innovation in satellite technology. These developments illustrate the interplay of technology, economics and geopolitics in shaping the region's future. India's vast and diverse population, with millions still disconnected from reliable internet access, presents an ideal landscape for Starlink's satellite internet services. Recognizing the need to reduce the digital divide, the Indian government has shown a willingness to embrace satellite technologies as a solution. By providing high-speed internet in rural areas, Starlink has the potential to empower underserved communities with access to education, healthcare and economic opportunities. However, Starlink's entry will likely disrupt the existing telecom market, challenging major players like Reliance Geo and Airtel. This competition could drive down prices and encourage improved service quality, benefiting consumers across the board. Furthermore, enhanced connectivity could support India's aspirations to grow its space economy and foster innovation in sectors such as e-commerce, remote work and digital finance. Despite these opportunities, compliance with India's strict data localization laws could prove a significant hurdle for Starlink, particularly in managing user data within regulatory frameworks. China's position as a leader in satellite technology places it in a unique relationship with Starlink. While the Beidou navigation system demonstrates China's prowess in space innovation, Starlink's expansion is viewed as both a competitive threat and a potential opportunity for collaboration in global satellite communications. This dual perspective reflects China's broader strategic interests in asserting technological leadership while managing the influence of foreign players in its markets. The geopolitical implications of Starlink's growth cannot be ignored. The proliferation of foreign satellite networks raises concerns about data security and national sovereignty, prompting Beijing to consider tighter regulations. 
Simultaneously, competition with Starlink could accelerate China's advancements in satellite technology, pushing the nation to develop more efficient systems and expand its influence in global satellite communications. Through these varied responses, India and China illustrate the multifaceted impact of Starlink's expansion. For India, it represents a tool for digital empowerment and economic growth, while for China, it serves as a catalyst for strategic innovation and geopolitical recalibration. These developments highlight the profound ways in which Starlink is reshaping South Asia's technological and economic landscape. Starlink symbolizes a pivotal leap forward in the quest for universal internet access, particularly in regions long underserved by traditional infrastructure. In countries like Nepal and Sri Lanka, its potential to bridge the digital divide is immense, promising enhanced access to education, healthcare and economic opportunities. However, as highlighted by regulatory challenges in both nations, the path to implementation is far from straightforward, underscoring the need for collaboration between governments and technology providers to realize its full benefits. For South Asian giants like India and China, Starlink's entry marks a turning point in their digital and economic landscapes. In India, it holds the promise of intensified competition better services and accelerated innovation, but it must overcome significant regulatory hurdles to succeed. Meanwhile, in China, Starlink serves as both a competitor and a catalyst for technological advancements, driving the country to refine its satellite capabilities while navigating the broader geopolitical implications of foreign satellite networks. As satellite internet services like Starlink continue to reshape global connectivity, nations must find a way to balance the opportunities for economic growth and digital inclusion with the complexities of regulatory frameworks and geopolitical concerns. Starlink's story in South Asia is one of transformative potential, offering a glimpse into a future where connectivity is truly universal and the digital divide becomes a relic of the past. That's it from the team at the Global Insight for now. We want to hear what you think. How does the introduction of Starlink in South Asia impact you or your community? Do you see it as a solution to connectivity issues in your region? And what are your thoughts on the regulatory challenges and geopolitical considerations surrounding this technology? As always, please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel here at the Global Insight. And until next time, stay tuned.